At this time, we'd like to acknowledge the presence of our Bishop, Bishop Harry Seawright, who has joined us. I had received a text that they were having difficulty getting mm -hmm. on the line. Bishop, is you, if you are available to speak, please greet us at this time. Oh, thank you. Can you hear us? Yes, sir. Okay, wonderful. As we come this moment, you, you know, well, first of all, let me just say we were having difficulties getting on. But uh, we are almost home. My priest at St. John Amy Church in Tuskegee this, this afternoon, and Reverend Sharita and I are traveling together. But we want to honor the Reverend Dr. Clementine Warren. I think she knows how much we love her, appreciate her, and thank God for her candidacy. Uh, she is on a call with me most Thursday nights where we have prayer with and for the candidates. And uh, she is a faithful person. We just going to Columbus, Ohio, with the expectation that we are all interested in electing her. And I want to commend the women in ministries for sponsoring this program tonight. We thank God for you and your support to her. But not only are uh, you supporting her, but we want her to know that the ninth Episcopal District is behind her. She is our candidate. And we are talking her up in every form, every fashion, praying for her and believing that God is going to get the glory and that it's all gonna work out. So thank you all so much, Reverend Sharita. She is driving, but she might not. Just hello, Reverend Clementine. Hope all is going well. We're praying for you, speaking victory and just believing God's gonna do it. So just keep pressing on and doing what you what you're doing. God bless you. Um, I'm going to challenge you all if we can all get together. If we can get 100 people to give her $100, at least that would give her $10,000. Amen. So if you all going to join me in on that challenge, Reverend Sharita and I are going to do more. But if we can get 100 people to give her $100, that would bless her campaign greatly. Thank you, Bishop, for the challenge. I know that the Ninth District Women in Ministry has already sown the seed of $100 from the Ninth Episcopal District WIM, as well as the Northeast Alabama Conference. I sent out uh, to the Women in Ministry and the clergy on the Northeast District uh, to support by sending a cash out. They can do so to our uh, WIM cash out, which is NEAC. W I M. Uh, All uh, funds will be given to the Reverend Doc Clementine Warren. Okay, wonderful. Thank you. So the spirit is really working because I didn't know that. Thank you all so very much. And Dr. Warren, would you please keep us posted as to how much you are receiving and who all is coming through and your wonderful leaders <laughs> like uh, Reverend Summons? Uh, y'all, please keep us posted on how it's looking. If we have to do this appeal again, we'll try to do it. But we have from now until uh, the week before the week of the general conference to do it. She needs it tonight. She needs it this coming week. Uh, the week of the general conference may be too late because she needs to do her appetizing. She got to get her lodging straight and even the people that she is going to bring to the conference to support her. Okay. Thank you, Bishop, um, for greeting us and for making that appeal. Um, Dr. Warren, we will be in touch. I will give you a, a spreadsheet of funds that we received from the Northeast Alabama Conference, and I'll coordinate with you for any that you may receive personally to your home address. But again, those who are on the line, please share our cash out. Please send it in and make note that it is for the Reverend Dr. Clementine Warren send-off celebration, and you send that to dollar sign. N E A C W I M N E A C abbreviation for Northeast Alabama Conference Women in Ministry W I M. Thank you. Wonderful. And the thing about it, when you help somebody else's vision come to light, God will blow yours up. You remember that. Thank you, Bishop. All right. Thank you.